Let's go to Delaware County now, where an Upper Darby neighborhood is shocked and shaken up over a deadly shooting. The victim, just a 22-year-old man, and Jeff, there were nearly 30 casings found at the scene. Yeah, the attackers were running and shooting. Look, our region continues to struggle with easy access to guns and gun violence. This time in Upper Darby, where a young Philadelphia man is literally chased and gunned down. The people living in the collection of homes are on Upper Darby's Penarth and South Keystone Avenues have spent their lives here. The quiet of this community of large stone homes was pierced in the early morning hours. I was sleeping and I heard all this pop, pop, bang, 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 pop, bang, 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 pop, pop. And I thought fireworks, but I thought fireworks, my foot. And gunshots. Repeated gunshots echoing in the dark as police say 22 year old Jamie Reed of Philadelphia was chased along Penarth by six attackers, some spraying gunfire. He dropped and died on this patio of an 88 year old homeowner. We believe that that was the scenario that they were lining in wait for him to come out. Something got him out of the building there, and that's when they approached him. A bullet struck this sedan near the home where Reed died, and just around the corner, a bullet tore through a grill and struck a window frame and wall. Grill, window, wall. Yeah. yeah. What do you make of this? It, it, it's just crazy. The, the most I'm glad of is I wasn't sitting in that spot. Because had you been, I wouldn't be here. None of the residents was injured. Investigators believe the attack was sparked by a dispute in Philadelphia, which spilled into neighboring Upper Darby. Police are scouring for video to ID the shooters, while a resident asking not to be seen on camera feels something's been lost in her lifelong community. And we have, you know, the mischief, the eggs, you know, the flat tires and things like that, but nothing like this. Um, in, you know, in my whole life, nothing like this. Po police do not know the nature of this dispute, but it ended like so many with gunfire, with bloodshed, violence, and eventual death. In Upper Darby at the police department, I'm Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News, folks. Jeff Cole, thank you very much.